Research done by Massachusetts General Hospital show that this new treatment is shrinking tumors dramatically and rapidly. Our NBC 10's Carla Rojo tells us more about this promising study. Keeps them whole, you know. There's nothing... Excuse me. It's almost been a year since Stephen Walker's wife, Heather Walker, passed away after battling an aggressive form of brain cancer known as glioblastoma. She was a longtime Boston Celtics executive. If only she had just had, you know, a little bit more time. She said that quite a bit. Now patients experiencing this type of brain cancer might get a little glimmer of hope in that much needed time, Stephen wished Heather had. A clinical trial done by Massachusetts General is showing promise. The research showed in three patients that a new treatment is shrinking tumors dramatically and rapidly. Our laboratory has been working for several years. The New England Journal of Medicine published the results of a phase one clinical trial using new cell therapy in patients with glioblastoma. Dr. Marcella Maus, whose MGH lab developed the treatment, tells us just days after a single infusion treatment, tumors dramatically reduced in size and for one person it remained nearly undetectable. We are giving the T cells directly into the fluid around the brain. We think that that really helps the T cells get to the tumor faster and in larger numbers. This image shows the before and after image of one patient's brain just five days after injection, showing the tumor dramatically shrunk. Dr. Brian Choi, a neurosurgeon at Mass General Hospital, says there is a lot of optimism with the study, even if it's in its early stages. This is the first CAR T cell cell therapy that has been offered to patients with glioblastoma within the MGP system. That's what people need with this when you just, you need time and hope. Dr. Marcella Mao says that this trial started back in March of 2023 so that there's still so much research to be done, but that this truly brings promise to so many families. Reporting in Boston, Carla Rojo, NBC 10 Boston.